filling in for Regis, who's on vacation, is my glorious better half, Mark Consuelo. Um, so I, I was reading this article today in the paper, and I thought of you immediately, immediately, that one in five Americans has experience with bed bugs. <laughs> and why does that make you think of me? Because I know how you are panic stricken about letting the kids go anywhere now, yeah. citing bed bugs. Right. I'm like, honey, I want to take the kids to see mm. a certain play. He's like, no, no bed bugs. Bed bugs. <laughs> like, in the play? It's really bothering me a little bit. It's really, I'm not, I don't understand this whole bed bug thing and how we've gotten to this point. I mean, you can literally almost land a plane with your iPhone, <laughs> with a new iPhone from Verizon, <laughs> apparently. But we can't. But what? This feels like we're back, like in pirate days, you know, on the ports. Ah, scurvy. Scurvy. <laughs> right? Does that? Doesn't it feel like that? Like bed bugs? Are bed bugs scurvy? I don't know. I feel like it's something a pirate had. Um, the, there was one of our kids uh, actually was sent home with a, with oh, a notice saying oh. that a, a classmate had bed bugs, like they had discovered bed bugs in their home. And in his classroom. And Mark was literally ready to move us to the moon. <laughs> He's like, as soon as, as soon as they find water up there, you know, that's where we're going. But, you know, I want, like, they have these dogs, right? Mm -hmm. They have these dogs that can sniff out these bed bugs. Like, I mean, I think, how do, first of all, how do they do that? You know, how does this dog, I remember when we were part, when we were going right next to that, that one bed bug truck and it had the dog yeah, the into dog, it, right. and I wanted to ask the guy. How does the dog how, know? And you wouldn't let me ask the guy? <laughs> Because we were driving on the freeway. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Look up that truck's phone number on your iPhone. <laughs> hey! How does the dog know? I, I'm always a little suspicious of those, like, those, those, um, those places that can come get rid of, like, lice and bed bugs. Because I feel like, if, I don't know. I know, like, it, 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 they just kind of sprinkle some in your house. Like, you got it. We have to take... Why, what's stopping them from just, like, sprinkling some in your, in your house? Because that's ridiculous. <laughs> it is ridiculous that people would do that. Really? We've had those lice people come to our house. Do you think that lady wants to stand there for 12 hours removing nits from the kid's she head? She met her match when she met me, didn't she? I you? know. I asked every single question in Spanish, English, Jamaican, whatever. I was... You were on I was her? on her, like, I wanted to know everything. Why is that a knit, and why isn't that a knit? She's like, because that's dandruff, and that's a knit. And then she brought out that giant thing, and, like, put it right. on the thing. Right. Remember that? Right. It was very difficult. We went from being the people who received the phone call of, my daughter was playing with your daughter, and now my daughter has lice. And I was like, oh, man. And so then we had um, the lice enders people come. Yes. And... And they found a knit in Lola's hair. And, and then guests. I had to call. Then I went from being the lady who received the phone call to the heel to making yeah. the phone call. And that's a much worse position to be in. I right. have to tell you, it's so hard to call and say, remember how my daughter was over? <laughs> and she rubbed her head all over everything in your house? <laughs> I had every single brush and like... He threw shammy. everything away. He no, I wanted to burn it actually. But I threw them in the dryer because I know that works. Mm -hmm. High heat. Works. High heat. Right. That's anyway. right.